Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. It is Lake8 here, and in today's video, we're going to be looking at a brand new Dragon game that has came to Roblox in early release. In today's video, I'll be showcasing this game as it is an early release, and it um, is free this week, and I just wanted to kind of showcase it. I have actually talked about this game on my channel before, I'm pretty sure, if I am not mistaken, and it is an amazing game, and I just can't wait to show you guys um, the game to in today's video but if you guys want to see more about this game make sure to stick tuned in today's video and also go to the description below if you guys want to join the game yourself the link for the game will be down below it is free to play this weekend and after this weekend it will be robux since it is of early release if you guys are new though make sure to subscribe if you are um, new and like this video if you guys want more of these videos on this game um, and with that said let's get right into it so this is a dragon roleplay game. I don't think there's any really survival in it, but it is an amazing game with what it has in the game. And I'll be showing you guys today uh, what we have basically. Now, some of these I don't have because I'm guessing these are game pass ones or you have to unlock them. I'm not exactly sure how you're supposed to get these ones if they're not playable or if they're um you have to get them basically by unlocking them. And of course, I think these two right here are Robux, as you can see this little coin sign. And I'm going to be guessing those are Robux. Robux. But we do have the one I played in my last video on this, which is this guy right here. I don't really know the name. I don't see a name for it around here. We also do have this guy as well. And of course, we have the one I played in the intro to, which is like a scorpion-like dragon, which is pretty cool. Now you can kind of see these dragons. I wish I could click on them to actually see what they look like without having to unlock them um, because I can't really tell what they look like from here. Now, some of them, I guessing you can't play as or they're not available or something like that so i'm guessing that's the case now on the right you can see we have ages which is elder adult juvenile and hatchling i can't really play as those i don't know if that's because one it's not in the game yet or you have to unlock it um you can also do info and stuff like that so we're gonna go ahead and edit you can actually customize your dragon now i haven't quite figured out how to do this necessarily um as i think i have to click on it or hit the scales i'm not exactly sure uh how i'm supposed to do this hold up oh wait oh okay those are animations so as you can see you can lift up your foot so if you want to get under i guess the foot for these little paddings here you can click on this you can also open the mouth which would be cool look at that you can see inside the mouth too that's so cool you can open the mouth and stuff like that um i can also hide everything so we can kind of just show the model from in here i also love the customization map it looks really cute and cool so you can individually color the dragon yourself um if you click the advanced button there you can just do this which uh i think i have to okay there you go see you can color individually oh that's cool i can do that uh the wings are one part and as you can see like the patterns and everything are different parts i'm just randomly clicking to kind of show you guys how it works and i think it's really smooth the advanced coloring part is smooth i'm not sure how this is supposed to work like am i supposed to click on the scales it, it doesn't really um kind of show me how to do that and it kind of i guess doesn't work i don't really know because when i click on it um and i do this it doesn't really work so i'm oh wait oh okay i get it so if you click on the scales right um you i think this bar has to be like there or something but you can basically do this and whoa that looks so cool so you just got to click on it i don't know why it wasn't working the first time but it did work so that is amazing oh i can make it all dark let's do that actually i want the eyes to be a pretty color so look at that and then maybe like the patterns i could put uh something Ooh, look at that that's cool I do want to put something on the wings, so maybe the membranes. Yes, look at that. So then once you're done coloring, you can also do the name, which is actually limited. You can do 20 uh, characters for that. We can also do 300 characters for the description, which is cool. I'm actually going to just put a name to kind of uh, showcase it, um, as you can see. So there we go. If we save it, it's going to say the colors you just applied will not be saved if you continue back. Oh, wait, hold up. I accidentally hit back. I was about to say, wait, what? Um, you can also change the time of day in this as well. If you click up here, I don't know what this does. Oh, this kind of angles the camera towards whatever you're trying to angle towards. So like the head, for instance, I can angle towards that. It's taking forever to save. 
I don't know what this paw is supposed to be, or actually, no, this is um accessories, but I don't know what the paw is supposed to be for. So after you finally finish the customization, you can actually, I guess it doesn't let you choose these, but it does say we have a forest, a desert, an ice plains, or I think it's plains, jungle, island, and sea. Um, I think it's only going to let me join the desert for now, because the other ones I can't really click on. You can also join your friends, and it will give you a description as well. Um, and you can just obviously join a random one, or you can join friends if you really want to. It might take a little bit for some reason, but... Um, I think that's it's the only one we have at the moment that you can actually play on, which is pretty cool. So once you spawn in, you can hit load save or default. I hit load save because you can see I have the one from the thumbnail and also the lizard we just made. Um, and you can load either one of those characters if you want to in this map. And once you load in, you basically are playing the game. Now we do have controls. I don't know what fine roleplay is. I'm guessing... Okay, so I'm guessing this is like something that you can host, um, which would be like something if you want to roleplay with other people. You can host it and stuff like that, as this game is mainly just roleplay, like I said. Uh, we do have animations, which of course we have flying, but I'll show that in a second. We have sitting down, and I'm pretty sure this is the same on mobile if you can actually play on mobile. Right now, I think it's only PC. I'm not exactly sure, but if you hit R, you sit down, R again, and R again. And then if you hit T, you stand up all together. I don't know if you hit R. Okay, so... You can just stand up. I don't think it, like, goes back up to, like, uh, the other resting or something like that. We have bowing, which you can do. And you can also hit N. And when you hit N, your wings kind of spread out. I love this. Like, look at that. That's so cool. We also do have some additional animations, like herding and biting, roar, and growl. Now, for the herding one, you can automatically just uh, kind of disable that once you run, basically. Um, the roar and the growl do not have anything yet. I don't see it. I don't hear it. Uh, we also don't have a biting animation yet. We do have an eating one, I think, if we find food. Now, I think if I go up here to drinking, I can drink the water. Alright, it doesn't seem like I can do it for this one, but the scorpion does have a roar, and you can also eat with, I mean, drink with that one. I don't know if I can eat with it, though, so I'm not exactly sure. The map is fantastic, though, and the background sounds are just amazing for the game. I think it fits it totally, and it sounds really good. The animations for the run are kind of wonky, though, not gonna lie, they look kind of wonky, but they can always improve as it is early access. Um, I think those are all the animations we have other than the um, sitting down and bowing and stuff like that. We of course have flying, which you can, I think, double space. Or is it? Is it double space? I'm trying to find- oh yeah, if you double space basically, you can fly or you can hit this uh, button down here that says flying um, and you can basically fly. Now I love the flying mechanics, I remember trying it before and you kind of glide when you go down and also dive. I love them. Like the mechanics for the flying are just amazing for this game. It looks really good. You can see we got some diving. We also have a turn radius with the when you turn with flying, which makes it uh, realistic. So if I hit Q, it's not really working. I don't know how I'm supposed to activate that. Um, I'm not exactly sure. I'm guessing if you just why is it not moving? Okay, I was about to say I'm guessing it's just like this basically. I don't know exactly what that's supposed to mean, um, but yeah, that's basically the flying animations. They look amazing. The map here is kind of uh, empty, but it is a desert, so that's expected. But it does look pretty cool so far. I really do love that. Oh, look. I think someone's playing as the scorpion. I wonder who that is. Look at that. So you can kind of see the size difference with these two. They look absolutely amazing. Um, show the wings. I don't think I can walk with- yeah, I can't walk with the wings open like that. But anyway guys, this is it for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. This game is absolutely amazing and I can't wait for the full release. Like I said though, it is paid so um, after this week I'm pretty sure you have to pay. I don't know how much Robux but for early release access, um, basically 
you would have to pay for it but right now it is free for the week so if you guys want to check this out while it's still free make sure to go to the link below and you guys can join it and play it basically it is definitely a game that has a ton of potential and i'm very excited for the future of this game i'm pretty sure the other ones the other dragons that we saw that don't have what well, you can't really see them i'm pretty sure they are not in the game yet or you have to basically unlock them somehow i'm not exactly sure but it is definitely a game i'm excited for comment down below what you guys are excited for the most and i'll see you guys in the next one bye